Hello guys, Mr. Pesek C here, and today we are going to be enhancing an older armor, um, an old friend of mine, called the Tectonic Plate Mail, um, <clears throat> or Tectonic Mantle. That was close, but um, these are the previous armors that I've maxed out, so the Druid Plate Mail has the most balanced, um, I think, was it, Draken Plate Mail has the highest attack, and the Sandstorm Plate Mail has the highest defense, while... Um, this one just has the element to it, but we will enhance it a different day, but hopefully I can fully enhance it um, later on later episodes. But today we're going to be doing the one of the first epic armors, the Tectonic Mantle. So that armor is pretty cool. Actually, let's equip this guy um, with a Blazeborn. So that's what the stats were back then. I, I don't know. It just... Brings me back nostalgia of a lot of these really cool armors. So let's just get right into it. Um, let's do this one first. And to be honest with you, I enjoy enhancing these armors more than the Heroic Lord armors. I'm not sure if it's just because of nostalgia, but they just look a lot cooler and um, I don't know, they just feel a lot nicer. And I, I believe just the stats are a lot more simpler. No ring your amulets really have to put into it. <clears throat> and it's just all stats. Um, let me use that one. We already have a Blazeborn. Uh, I think that's really it there. I mean, let's use this one here. And let's go. I think the max is 99. I always forget that the max is 99. Um, I don't plan on enhancing that one. Let's do that anymore. Oh, I should have enhanced the Maelstrom. Oh, man. Some of these armors are so cool because they're so old, but um, I think I'm just down with Earth, so let's just go with Earth Fusion Boost then. Just keep going that. And Arbor Steel is also a really old one, too. But, well, seeing a lot of these really old armors are pretty cool. It'd be nice if it had the plus, but that's not the case. So that's what it looks like. I think it'll when it first came out, it looked super cool. I still think it's really cool. <clears throat> and it was unkillable um, because of its high defense. And I don't know, every time I went to go, or people were raiding with it, I mean, not raiding, um, Arena with it, it was so annoying. So annoying back in the day. Wow, it's actually getting harder to enhance here. 90. Let's just do one of these. Almost. Okay, let's just do a regular. We have a regular fusion boost here. Or well, we could just do a fire. I should do it. Perfect. There you go. So these are the stats. So super high defense not as much as the sandstorm plate mail but a lot of the mono armors back then were more common so and they weren't as strong so like the northern uh which one call it northern's battle gear so these were kind of the armors that came out um back then i don't think there's a there wasn't really an air armor that was a mono i could say there were air armors but not a mono one that i remember um, a spirit one. I'm not sure if there was a spirit one back then, too. No, not particularly. Um, maybe Armor of the Devoted, but... <clears throat> um, but yeah, these are kind of the cool designs. I don't know. I, I loved them a lot back then. I think these old armors definitely should come back. Maybe a lot stronger, of course, but I think that'd be really cool. But anyway, that's all for this video. So please, slick, lick, and like and subscribe. So I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.